This video will explain what the ratings mean when talking about fuses. Two important factors fuses are rated by are current and voltage. The current or amp rating determines at what current the fuse will blow and open the circuit. Never use a fuse of a different amp rating. Once a fuse has blown or opened the circuit, the voltage rating is very important. To understand why, think of static shock and how it will shock you before you have touched anything. Static shock is a low current, high voltage discharge. The reason static shock happens before you physically touch an item is because the higher voltage the charge is, the more potential it has for arcing to complete the discharge. To apply this to fuses, consider the following. A low voltage fuse such as a 32 volt 10 amp is replaced with a higher voltage fuse rated at 250 volts and 10 amps. Since both fuses have the same current rating, it will blow at the same current. The voltage rating of the fuse is also higher than the original fuse, so there is no chance of damage to the equipment. This is because the space between the conductors and the fuse are far enough apart after the fuse blows to prevent any arc between the conductors. Never replace a higher voltage fuse with a lower voltage fuse. For example, replacing a 250 volt 5 amp fuse with a 120 volt 5 amp fuse. This can be very dangerous. The current rating is the same, so the fuse will open or blow at the correct current. However, a fuse of a lower voltage rating has less space between the conductors once blown, so a low voltage fuse used in a high voltage environment could potentially arc after opening. This would defeat the safety that a fuse provides, thus allowing the circuit to stay energized even after the fuse is blown. This concludes today's demonstration.